Hey, hi, welcome back. Today I want to talk about the landing page feature of the GetResponse tool. Now, GetResponse marketing, email marketing tool is extremely powerful and we have seen in our previous videos, but I want to talk about the landing page tool itself. And trust me guys, it's one of the most powerful tools as well. Okay, now you can build and pu publish stunning landing pages. Uh, you, know, you can collect leads automatically with no designs, no HTML editor, no tech guy in your team and you know, no tech skills you need and you can create landing pages in less than 10 minutes. Now why I say that land, uh, get response tool is extremely powerful is for the fact that at just somewhere about just 1,100 rupees, just 1,100 rupees per month, you get to maintain 1,000 leads, okay? You get to maintain 1,000 contacts, you can send them emails, uh, n number of emails. You can create landing page templates, you can create forms and surveys. That's why get response tool is the most powerful tool and one of the most, uh, one of the cheapest uh, as compared to any other tool in the market okay now if I want to compare uh, if I want to buy a landing page tool uh, uh, let's say lead pages let's say insta page let's say unbound or click funnels I have to spend no less than 4000 rupees okay 4000 is starting price per month if I want to create landing page tool itself and then plus on top of that you have to add the cost of email uh, marketing tool as well so you have to spend somewhere about eight ten thousand rupees for your emails for your landing pages itself but this tool provides you both at at just a price point of about thousand hundred rupees or something right so uh, why landing page tool uh, of get response is important is uh, it has hundred plus responsive designs okay mobile optimized as well you have easy drag and drop editors uh, you can do a lot of AB split testing. AB split testing is nothing but um, you can create variants of that particular landing page with different call to actions. Okay, and you can optimize. You can you can know which uh, call to action, which or uh, what are the changes in a particular landing page is working and which is converting more than the other variant. Okay, it's one of the most powerful techniques. And if you want to create high converting landing pages, you have to do AB split testing. Okay, apart from that, you have. Uh, uh, pre-designed thank you templates you have 110 plus landing page template this is the most amazing part of it okay if you're into niche and if you get lucky and if you're in niche you will already have pre-generated templates over there you just have to pick it up you have to put your text you have to put your image you have to put your call to action and less in less than 10 minutes you can create a landing pages okay next is advanced uh, form builders you have advanced google analytics as well uh, integrated in this and so that's about it so these are the best features about get response landing uh, page tool okay and there's no other website you just have to you can sign up and you can you know buy the basic package and you can start making your first landing page okay now if you go into this email marketing was all about uh, newsletters we learned about autoresponders in my previous emails and then right now we're learning about landing pages, the growth tools okay under growth tools you'll find landing pages let's get to that and let's create the first page now I want to create a new one, right? So 110 plus templates pre-generated and trust me guys, these are not random templates. Uh, there's an again, artificial intelligence behind it. A lot of people all over the world use these templates and they've seen success and that's how they generate it. Okay. So people have got success by using these templates and that is why they upload it. Uh, they, they load it over here for you to use it. Okay. Either you can build it from scratch by using different editors okay this is also a very easy process but uh, we're just gonna pick up uh, one of the templates over here and we're gonna go ahead okay i'm gonna say hi testing whatever and then thank you page also you can name it okay so this is how your landing page is going to look like and this is how your thanking th thank you page is going to look like okay so let's see i want to go with some other one let's say this one okay yeah so uh, this one an NGO, NGO landing page, lead collection or whatever. Yeah, thank you says you're a member now. Okay, so I want to, if you want to make somebody a member of the part of the NGO, this is what template that you're going to use. And you can customize it as well. Okay, so I'm going to quickly take you through the dashboard, how it, how it looks and what are the features that it provides. Okay, first things first. So this is a variant with A. As I told you about AB split testing you can create a b split test over here so here i'm going to create a variant b and here it says email address so instead of sign up become a vip member this is this is what my variant b is going to say okay 
join our foundation and transform lives is what I'm going to say okay and transform lives so this will help us realize what words are working which image is working if I want to change the image I can wait so look at the variant day variant day says join a foundation and make your mark and sign up alone okay in but in second one join a foundation and transform lives become a VIP member okay this might generate more curiosity among people what is a VIP member they want to give their email address so this is how you can create variations so what this particular landing page tool will do is it will send 50% of the traffic to variant A it will send 50% of traffic to variant B and it will show you the results at the end you might see that in variant A only uh, 15 people are filling the uh, form in uh, variant B you will find 35 people are filling the form out of 50 uh, members just for the sake of uh, an example okay so 50 in variant A uh, 50 in variant B only 15 fill here in variant A and 35 fill uh, in uh, variant B so of course you realize that uh, the power of the words that you have changed is extremely crucial here and you can just go ahead with variant B and you can discard uh, variant A just go and discard uh, variant A and you can just you know um, you can just uh, then you can optimize and you can create a few more variants so you can create as many variants as you want here right and this is how the, the traffic is going to split uh, among as many uh, variants you're trying to create so that's about it and then thank you pages here so you can make uh, changes to thank you pages right here uh, then and there right so here is this and next is mobile optimize uh, mobile version as well so this is how the mobile version is going to look the the one between the aqua lines is what you see is how it's going to look in the mobile version as well okay so you can make changes you can customize it see it's going little of the line so you can you know reduce the size of it and everything but pretty much looks uh, pretty clean uh, altogether so this is how you can see the mobile version if you click on the preview button how it's going to look like uh, yeah how it's going to look like it show you, uh, shows you in the uh, web page right next is html then you have settings uh, which is your uh, how do you create your meta title uh, meta description and everything over here uh, and then you have additional settings which is your favicon and facebook icons so if somebody shares the landing page you can create uh, you know wh what image to be shared on the social media channels you can upload it over here right so this settings comes uh, in the next page also and we'll uh, talk about that in the next setting okay then you can save it you can save and exit if you want to come back and work on it again you can save it as a template if you if you think that you're going to use it again and again over time right so this is how uh, the what this is how the landing page is going to look like now let's look at the tools on the right look let's look at the form builders let, let let's look at these uh, elements okay first things first this is the one in the rectangle is nothing but a section if you want to add another section here see the blue line that you see it's going to add a section over here so i've created another section right now and if i want to add something i can add I, if i want to remove it i can just remove it okay and if i want to push it above this particular one this is what the arrows talk about okay so this is uh, how the section going to look like if you want to add a shopping cart okay you can create a store itself this is such a powerful tool and that is not it you can create a shopping cart you can create a pdf file you can create an online course uh what not okay it acts like an lms in itself so this is so powerful and i leave it up to you how do you want to uh play around this but with this particular aspect but i'm just going to cover the basics which is which is the heart of the landing page okay next is nothing but simple drag and drop text button you can add your text change the color you can change the color you can add a, a, a external link to it you can add an image you can just uh, you know uh, align it left right center uh, change the font change the text and everything okay so this this is what the text tool is about this is nothing but an image just add an image over here okay you can edit you can replace right and next is call to action button let's not possible okay here i'm gonna add the button over here just gonna make some changes right so you can um, you know this is your call to action button here you see this is this says sign up and if you want to say uh, you know register myself now and then once they click you can divert them to different external tools uh, different uh, web address okay either you can uh, divert them to web address you can give the link URL you can give the title and you can if you want them to uh, open it in a new window or the same video you can click on this one okay very easy tool guys extremely easy uh, stuff 
it's it's just DIY uh, things and you can just create amazing looking landing pages right <clears throat> so that was about buttons now this is static form and pop-up forms okay now every uh, uh, landing page will definitely have a preloaded form this is a form which has only email address if you want to add some more you can add uh, more uh, uh, fields to this okay so let's say I want to create a static form here again this is how it is I can add some more uh, form let's say see I was able to create one uh, I'm gonna align it here and I'm gonna push it down a bit okay so yeah this is how it is ready I'm gonna delete this extra ones <coughs> right so this is how it's gonna look like and okay some issue with this one it's not performing right okay this is how you can make changes you can you can add fields and with the help of uh, static forms and you can have a pop-up form as well so once I click on the pop-up form let's see let's say this is where the pop-up form looks like so you can create sign-up form you can create an exit pop-up if, if you want to still collect leads from people saying hey are you leaving so fast why are you doing that and why not attend my free webinar or free uh, why don't you download my free ebook something like that you can create a download form fixed bar image form scroll form you just have to go and experiment on this one okay so yeah you can create forms you can add more fields to it you can create a call to action button and uh, static form pop-up forms you can create from here next is this is nothing but just graphic elements just shapes uh, if you want to create some graphic elements out of the landing page this is the tool to go to webinar okay uh, now if you see it says upgrade now this is available only for I think pro version of it but if you want to integrate your webinar into the landing page it will automatically so uh, get response tool also gives you a webinar option you can host up to 100 people in your webinar if you buy the pro pack okay and once you create that you can connect the entire you can entirely automate uh, you know once the lead is generated it will di automatically divert them to the webinar and so on so this feature is extremely important if you are buying that particular pack you can just go and you know uh, create all the landing page uh, elements uh, all the webinar elements over here itself you can give all the information about the webinar right here and then and then and there okay this is uh, also an extremely cool feature which is nothing but your uh, countdown uh, uh, timer this is used for creating urgency fear of missing out saying it's starting in one day and uh, blah 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 so this is this is how you can you know set up the timer as well next is video if you want to set up a video you can you can then link it to uh, uh, YouTube and uh, so on right fifth uh, the Twitter tweet bot that you see if you want to create uh, elements uh, social media elements and link them to your uh, Facebook page to your Twitter page uh, to your uh, Pinterest uh, plus one and share so you don't they don't have Instagram option you have to create it on your own right and then here you can uh, use the PayPal button to integrate the paying options uh, in my next uh, in in the videos uh, you will be learning how to integrate PayPal button and how you can collect payments right then and there on your landing page and this is your HTML editor if you want to add a custom code you can do that uh, this is especially useful if you want to integrate let's say SoundCloud music uh, or if you want to add InstaMojo payment link uh, customized one you can al also add InstaMojo payment link over here using this particular HTML editor so that's about it and then we move to the next step yeah I don't want to um, I can continue without uh, mobile version yes so we have come to the page title uh, this is how your SEO settings uh, should uh, look like like if your page your landing page gets started ranking on the uh, Google search engine how it's gonna look like uh, please join me for Instagram influence uh, this more description will appear as your site description the maximum is 250 characters gives you more options here you can create a new domain okay 
if you want to host this particular landing page on your uh, let's say blog on your website this is where you add it okay and there are uh, if you want to add a c name entry to your subdomain if you want to change dns settings there are tutorials in in uh, get response itself so i want you to go through that and create uh, and you know add your own domain over here this is easy step by step process i'm not going to uh, take you in depth of this just go ahead add your own domain add your own blog or your uh, website over here and you can start hosting these landing pages onto the uh, 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 url uh, landing page right next subscription settings choose list i can create uh, if if there is a form over here i can link it to the list and you know uh, the the leads will start getting collected over there and then you can set up auto responders as well so you're connecting landing page uh, to your list and then to your auto responder and to your newsletter so it's like an all in one tool that covers all the aspects of it you know it covers all the automation aspects of it right confirm opt in is nothing but uh, never go for confirm opt in guys you're going to lose a lot of customers confirm opt in is nothing but once if you click on this and if a guy gives his uh, details onto the form let's say he gives his name email and phone number in the email another uh, email will be triggered to them saying you do you really want to uh, opt into this particular list okay why, why this is done is to create a white list okay so uh, from there on your emails will never go into their spam box it will only go into the inbox okay but most of the time uh, it always goes to the inbox itself instead of uh, if your sp spam score is less it's going to go to the inbox any which way so you don't want to do this because uh, people might like, might not confirm up in uh, uh, if you're just starting out uh, in your journey okay so just uh, you know switch it off add into the cycle on day so day 0 how many messages you want to send again the auto responder comes into picture default thank you page and if you want to integrate your analytics and remarketing google ads uh, conversion tracking pixel you can do all that over here and we will see how that is done in different landing page tool as well and then you can just go and publish and then voila you're ready so this is how the landing page is going to look like if i click yes join a foundation transform lives so i'm right now i'm seeing a variation b right what we created so you see this is the first is showing me a variation b of it and this is how it looks like got it right and then if you can create another page you can create your landing page and you can just you know manage your landing pages over here so this is amazing guys uh, i hope you learned something amazing today i learned about landing pages i hope you create your landing page and connect all the dots over here so that you can automate the entire process thank you for listening to me i will see you in the next class